I knew I wanted to go to New York City because even growing up in Cape Cod, I had never really been to New York. So New York, you know, just this huge, giant place, filmmakers, writers, illustrators, you know, actors. Um, I needed to go there. So I moved back to Cape Cod and my parents um, rented cottages. Uh, that was their income as five of those kids grew up. And I started uh, working with my dad just to get a toehold after I moved back from school and everything. And, and um, I was living in Provincetown, that's where we had some of the cottages. And I knew that I couldn't do that long because I needed to get to New York. So I was always sketching, drawing, getting a portfolio of all kinds of stuff together. I didn't have the 12 or 15, you know, pieces that all looked the same. I had this big, huge box I bought at a thrift store filled with like sculptures and figure drawings and sketches and paintings and all kinds of stuff. So I would go to like bookstores, Barnes and Noble, Borders and, and uh, independent bookstores and I would just look at books and pour of them and I would just see who, any book that I kind of got excited about, I would see who published it. So I got this big fat New York phone book and I just started calling and finding out, you know, these numbers. And usually it was just a general number to the, to the front desk or something. And they would tell me, well, drop off policy, you know, you can leave your portfolio, you know, Monday through Wednesday, nine to five or whatever. And I was like, I don't want to just drop something off. I can't. It's just, I need to show this and talk. So I would come up with this thing where I, I would tell them I'm a lighthouse keeper on Cape Cod, I went to Art Center, I'm painting all the time, I have some really cool stuff I want to show you, I just have to show you this stuff. And um, I, within that week, and, and it was like acting, I kind of had the phone set up and everything there, my little notepads, and I'd take a deep breath and pick up the phone and call and put on the, the show kind of thing. And they just, the, the ladies I talked to, whatever they say, they, they would just be so happy to hear, you know, the excitement and and they said, you know, the, the exuberance that you showed you know, just was kind of uh, you know contagious so let's let's have you over here we'll, we'll make an appointment so within that week I probably made uh, six or seven appointments to see art directors and go up and show my book and um, I remember going to Grand Central Station and uh, first leaving the Cape was a funny thing just getting on this little bus and here's a couple of people locals from Provincetown and they're heading out of town and they never head out of town you know it's like so I just hop on with my little box and and I'm sitting there and there's all these little nicknames this guy squeaky and this guy over here you know <laughs> they're all fishermen and everything and they're you know squeaky why are you leaving town he's like he's just like I'm going to my brother's birthday I'm leaving Cape Cod it's like he's all dressed up with his hair combed this side and um I was like well I'm going to New York and so um I get to Grand Central Station and I didn't know how to get out of there. I was just like a little kid just looking around at the, the size and the, the amount of people and I actually went up to one little booth and I said, you know, how do you get out of here to like the street and he thought it was kind of kidding, you know, like like I was being a wise guy or something and so eventually you know, I get to the street and I got this, there's no GPS, I didn't have any of that, you know, at that time. Just had these addresses and figured it out and I felt so great about going up an elevator knowing that I actually have an appointment with an art director and you know when you go to art school and you're just so excited to get a job and you're like wow I'm gonna possibly get something maybe not but just the fact that I can go have an interview this is awesome.